Hey guys, I'm back. Um, wanted to do another video um, before time got away from me here um, on the, with the back to school series. Since we just got back from our elementary open house, we start school on Monday, so starting to think about all the things related to school. So if you watch back, you can go back to older videos. I've done videos um, focused on um, health and wellness and on um, keeping critters out of the hair. Um, today I'm going to talk about focus a little bit. Um, this is um, one that's obviously very important because it's something that the kiddos need to do while they're at school, right? They need to focus. They need to focus on what they're doing, on their teachers, on their assignments. Um, not just at school, but at home when they're doing their homework. Um, and so there was a a blend that I made last year that worked really well for the kids and um, my youngest Mallory on the first day of school even said she noticed a difference when she used it and used it throughout the entire year so I'm gonna make that for you today um, the and um, the, the way that these work if you're wondering well how do essential oils help with focus um, not only do them getting into your bloodstream help in all sorts of ways but even just the smell of them affect your limbic system and I noticed that the initial video I did a couple like a month ago uh, kind of like my intro video of, uh, about oils in general um, disappeared I think I must have forgot to save it but in that video I if you didn't catch that back then I I talked about how the science behind essential oils and even just smell them um, will affect your your brain um, because what happens is the smell of the oils, the constituents in the molecules will actually get into your limbic system and your limbic system is called like your emotional brain. And so when you're talking about things like emotions, like focus, like mental type of things, um, it's going to make a difference. So the limbic system, I'm just going to, I have it written down here. The limbic system is directly connected to heart rate, blood pressure, breathing, memory, stress levels, hormone balance, and can have a have a profound effect on physiologically and psychologically. So that is how, how when it comes to things like focus, energy, different emotional things, essential oils can be very beneficial. And even not just by using them on your body, but just by smelling them. So um, that's one reason why I love them, because if you are you know on a budget or you just maybe want to get the starter kit and don't make, you don't have... Um, fun to get much more beyond that for a while. Um, if you decide not to do it as a business, which you absolutely don't have to, then you can actually just use them by opening up the bottle and smelling it. You don't even actually have to use it to get a benefit from them, which is awesome. And so, um, of course, when you use them, then it gets into your bloodstream and then you actually get a lot more benefit from them. But um, if you just need it for like an emotional reason or a thing um, like focus or those kinds of things, you can just smell them and that will help you, which is really, really awesome. That's right, one of the things I really, really love. Um, and so there's a couple things before I make the roller bottle that I'm going to make tonight that we that the girls use. They actually take it to school with them and so far that's been okay. But you could even just... Um, you know, have it in the room and have them use, like put it on their temples before they go to school. You don't have if you don't want them to have it at school, that's totally fine. Really good to just you know use if you have tests or whatever, or use before you do homework. Um, anyway, before I get to making that, I want to quickly talk about a couple things that Young Living has already kind of pre-made for you that are are um, meant to help with things like focus. So they do have, um, I talked about how they have a Kid Sense line, and this is just a line of oils that they have that is already pre-diluted. So they've already combined a mix of oils for you for a specific purpose, and then they've pre-diluted it for you. So that you can just give these to the kids, and they can use them, and you don't have to worry about adding any carrier oils. And I'm going to talk about that again, too. The carrier oils are basically like your fatty oils, because um, essential oils themselves are not fatty, um, but carrier oils are. And so carrier oils are gonna help disperse the essential oils um, on, onto your skin, but they're also gonna help in case any of the oils happen to be hot oils, which some are. It'll help, um, di it'll dilute them, basically. It'll actually make them, um, it'll help with them sinking into your system because essential oils can tend to evaporate pretty quickly and so it's really good especially with kids um, to have to have dilution is really important and the bottles all tell you how to dilute them so if it'll say 
um, if it doesn't need to be diluted, if it needs to be diluted, it'll say dilute one to four or that kind of thing. And you can use any kind of fatty oil, not like vegetable oil, um, like you get from the store, but like olive oil, coconut oil, um, jojoba, grapeseed. Um, and then Young Living actually makes their own um, oil complex called V6 that I usually use, but I also use coconut oil quite a bit. So the Kids Sense lines are, are already have dilution in them, so you don't have to worry about them. This one's called Genius, and it has um, a variety of wonderful oils in it already. So this is also one that I just have the kids keep in their room, and they can just um, take it, and they can either just smell it, they can put it in their diffuser with water, diffuse it in their room. So it's a great thing, like get home from school, the first thing our kids have to do is do their homework so they can pop this in their diffuser diffuse it while they're doing their homework and it's gonna help them focus it's gonna help them like just nail down what they're doing so this is a wonderful wonderful um, oil they also have a supplement um, called MindWise and um, this is something that the kids is for kids and adults both kids just take like one to two teaspoons a day and it just again supports kind of the brain your brain health and I'm going to talk about that a little bit because um, it's a really cool supplement. Um, it has sachi and chi nut oil and a whole bunch of essential oils in there to support brain and cardiovascular function. So it has peppermint, fennel, anise, lemon, and lime. And you just consume it um, with a meal. And so it's just another supplement that can help... Um, help support um, brain health so that's something that um, I you know the kids and I or you know all of us will take so okay now for the roller blend um, there's four oils in this one and this is tried and true with our family I'm telling you what this stuff is amazing um, it is the four are frankincense and one thing you'll notice with all of these is that these oils, the constituents that are in them are very grounding. They're very, um, a lot of these are used for kind of relaxing, kind of grounding the body a little bit and just that's what's helping them be good focus oils is because they're kind of getting everything, um, they're, they're getting their bodies relaxed a little bit to like just hone in on what they're doing. And so frankincense is one of those. Frankincense is such a great, great oil. It's not just good for, um, for focus, but it's good for a lot for um, spiritual and emotional um, things. And so this is great to have in this, um, in this blend because it has so many benefits to it. Cedarwood is, anytime you see an oil that is like from a tree, um, you'll know that it's a very grounding oil. So if you are in high amount of stress or um, anything like that, any kind of oil from a tree is a really good oil. Um, and cedarwood is amazing. Cedarwood is also um, great for your hair. <laughs> Just had to throw that in there. Vetiver is um, an amazing oil. This is such a great oil, again, for grounding, for dealing with stress, for um, obviously for focus, which is why it's in here. This is actually right, I would say it's tied with frankincense for my favorite oil, and it's a very inexpensive oil. Um, this is one of those, I, the first time I smelled it, it just, oh, I just love it. It was one of those things where I just connected and like this is like my oil. So vetiver is one of my favorite oils. And then the fourth one is lavender. Lavender is used for so many things, um, but it is a good like relaxer. It's really great for sleep support. Um, don't worry, it's not going to like make your kids fall asleep while they're doing their homework, although they'd probably rather be doing that. But it's just something that's going to kind of calm their emotions down a little bit. It's going to kind of get them to not be thinking about all the other stuff going on, which again is why it's in this focus blend. Um, lavender is so great for so many things. They call it the Swiss knife, Swiss army knife oil, Swiss army oil. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I don't know if I said that right. Basically because it can do so many things. Like this thing is great for skin support. It's great for um, hair. It's great for... Um, relaxation um, I'll my next video is going to be focused on sleep and resting because of course that is very important for our kiddos to get good nights of sleep to, to continue with um, doing well in school and so lavender will show up again many times um, and so that's a really really good one so this recipe is very easy I'm just gonna do 10 drops of each and then I'm going to add in my carrier oil um, 
and vetiver, okay, vetiver. Vetiver is a thick one. Um, so I'm gonna just kind of hold it. I'm gonna warm it up a little bit here real quick. <laughs> so I'll do the other ones first. Cedarwood is a really good one. I just love this one. All right. If anyone has any questions, let me know. Like if um, I'm happy to answer them while I'm on. Um, Lavender and frankincense are two that you would get with your starter kit, so they're wonderful ones that you will get to start using right away if you, um, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, which is amazing because they're very good oils. All right, let's see if Edward's thinned out yet here. Sometimes I have to take the topper off and I might have to do that. So, yeah, so we had our open house tonight. Okay. And we are ready to go. All right, that's pretty close. Um, just got all that paperwork to fill out, which I'll probably have to use my focus oil for because <laughs> that gets to be a lot. A lot of paperwork. But. I don't know, but how about those of you who have kiddos, are they all ready to go back? I know mine finally are getting there. It's taken a little bit, but I think we're, we're ready. So then I'm just going to fill, fill her up with the carrier oil here. I forgot my labels, but I'll label it as well. And it smells so good. These are great just to use as perfume. Like, you can make... Um, you can make your own perfumes just with these roller bottles and then you know you're getting a benefit from your perfume versus a bunch of toxic chemicals <laughs> that's in the fragrances. Um, and so I love making perfumes. Like I love just finding mixes of oils that I really like and then that's um, what I do often and it's much healthier for you. So there we go, easy peasy. Um, Focus oil. I'm just gonna give it. I know we had one a little bit left from last year, from the one we the girls used last year. So I'll just give this to them, and then when that one's out, we can reuse that bottle, and I'll start with this one. So, um, I think that's it. I didn't have a whole lot more. Um, there was another recipe that I found that actually used instead of um, frank and lavender, use vetiver peppermint and cedar wood, which I think would also be a very good one, and it would be more minty. So you could try that one. Um, peppermint is really good for um, energy as well, and so that would might be a really good one to like help with the focus. That's one I might just make and then have maybe the girls try them both and see which one they like better, because every oil is different, and every, every person's gonna react differently. And so like I said, Mallory, um, this combo I made her last year, and instead of like, on her first day of school last year, instead of talking about how she saw her friends and how she liked her teachers and da da da, the first thing she said was, Mom, those oils really worked, or that focus oil worked, and she asked for it regularly. And so um, it just, I just don't think she would ask for it if it didn't truly help her. Like she really noticed a difference. And so um, I'm just thankful that I have these to use for the girls as they're, because it's, it's hard. You get, have a lot of distractions in your classrooms and, um, you know, a lot of things you're thinking about. And my youngest has always been one that's always been thinking ahead of herself. She's always like, when's recess? When's, you know? And so grounding her was kind of real, last year I was really thinking about how can I get her grounded because she's always thinking ahead. And so um, I think it just really made a huge difference for her last year. So I'm excited to have both the girls um, and both girls used them, but Mallory's the one that really um, talked about it um, on a regular basis that it helped her. So. Anyway, that is it, guys. I, tonight, uh, short and quick. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to talk about um, sleep and rest. And there's, of course, that along with um, nutrition and um, and good eating, you know, that kind of thing is all very important. But sleep and rest is a huge one because um, sleeping is when our body kind of, re, kind of covers itself and detoxifies and gets 
ready for the next day and um, if we if you know if our kids don't get that or get restful sleep then that can have an impact on them not just with things like focus but also with just how well they do in school and how well they interact with other people so I'm going to talk about that more in depth tomorrow so anyway I'm gonna go if you guys have any questions and um, let me know otherwise um, if you, yeah if anyone if any of you want to try any of these or if you are interested in signing up um, let me, you know, message me. I can sure help you and get you started. I'd be happy to help you. I love to support anyone who signs up, like helping with different things, trying out different recipes with people. Like I, I, um, that's a huge part of what I want to do is I want to be, and why I'm doing these videos is I want to just give people ideas and help, help you all with your families and the health of your families. And so, um, just holler if you have any questions and, um, I will be back uh, in the next day or two. Have a good night, everybody. Bye-bye.